Alright, this video isn't confirming anything at all. It's just got a question on my mind. So, if you remember, a while ago now, we had a Porsche dealership in the game. And it was nothing like this one one bit. It was, like, based on a real-life Porsche dealership. And, I mean, yeah, that's that's what it was. And seeing as we're having Porsche licensing, seeing as, I mean, it's confirmed now. They recently put out a sneak peek. Like, actually, just with the logo, you know, whatever. We already kind of knew anyway. Um, yeah, now, seeing as it's confirmed, could that Porsche dealership come back? Now, I want to say, I would love the Porsche dealership to come back to the game. And soon as we do have the Porsche licensing on their way, I mean, there is a big chance that the dealership could, like, arrive. Thing is, Driving Empire would have to license that dealership separately to the cars. Now, I don't know if they have, like, thought of, like, licensing the dealership. Because, I mean, if they're licensing cars, I feel like I don't know how hard it is to license a dealership. I guess it could be a little bit harder than licensing cars. But I feel like licensing a dealership, it's a whole building, it's not multiple things. Now, it would be lovely to get that dealership back because it was a very iconic piece of, like, Driving Empire on the map, really. And, I mean, it would be really nice to have it back. But to me, I don't think that they will add it this update. Like, I would love it, but I don't think they will add it this update. And even if they do license a dealership, I don't know if it will be until like the new map arrives when they actually have the new map so we can have a new licensed dealership it would be really cool like, it would be really cool but at the moment we don't know and to be honest i don't know if that would actually like come because i mean this dealership has been around for a while after they you know started adding fake models and i feel like they might not change it even though i don't like it and a lot of people don't like it either i don't think they're gonna change it just because people don't like it it just says there's a dealership it you know whatever i do think it would be really nice to have the porsche dealership back but now that like this dealership is here there's like you know the car stands in the dealership they've got the pagani thing there i feel like they could change up the old dealership to have some like places like this like you know they've got the new car bits here which i mean they could actually fit in the old porsche dealership it's just they have to like obviously move it i don't know i think it could work very like i think it would work but i just don't know if they would actually do it because i mean it's a whole dealership now like i said i would love it but we don't know now there are other dealerships that we could be having like, if they license other dealerships, like, we could have a Pagani dealership, a Lamborghini dealership. But those aren't as interesting, I guess, as the Porsche dealership. And we've also already had the Porsche dealership in-game. And people already like that dealership, or did like it. And it was, obviously, like I said, iconic to the game. I feel like it would be fitting if we just have that back. At the end of the day, it's up to Giant Empire to see if they reach out to Porsche and see if they can get it licensed. Not if they, like, will, I guess. Because, I mean, it would cost money if they want, if we want that back in game because of licensing, I guess. And I don't know if Oldix is prepared to pay for a dealership. It would be really cool. But at the moment, we don't know at all. So, like I said, it would be really cool. Tell me what you think if... The Porsche ship could come back and whatever if you really want it to come back. But I don't know. Let me think about this and have a good day.